The Facebook post that uh, was made in February 2021 emanated from the many campaigns that I was leading in the community in relation to this mine. And they also emanated from the research made of these mining dams, how they affect communities. The only response that we got, which was not communicated to us, was the Department of Water and Sanitation. That has got the responsibility to ensure that there is compliance matters and they managed to close down the mine, which was last year, December 2021, for a period of three months. As to what has happened after the three months and them reworking on a strategy on compliance matters, we were not informed as a community as to whether is the continuation of this particular operation proper or not. I can show you pictures of this wall three, four days before the accident, and you won't be able to tell me that there was a mask. region of about 367 people in Bloemfontein, in hotels. There's people in, 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 in the neighboring town, put up in, in hostels there. There's numerous food. You know, I've, I've had a meeting this morning with a committee for the victims. The, the mayor established a committee for the victims. And it was amazing to see how these people are willing to work with us and we've established a joint committee now. Now that this has happened, I think there must be a re dialogue of all the stakeholders, starting the process of fresh, taking the community into consideration. And it's really painful because if this had not happened, where did it happen? Or on the other side, on the right side, it was going to wash away the entire community. We're just like it managed to do only one portion.